So here's our first test of the breathing mobile washer. We don't really need to do this. We have a washing machine inside, but I just want to get an idea of if this is something that might work for the summer, because if not, it's not going to be this investment. It's going to be getting an electrician and a plumber to help us put a washing machine and maybe a dryer into the office. So let's see if this might work first. So, two buckets, they don't look that clean, but I just washed them out. I'm going to put like a spoonful of soap in. This is by no means precise. Maybe that was more than I needed. Got some suds. And then the thing we'll be washing a lot of this summer, cloth diapers. Let's see. Maybe I'll start with a few and add more. Here goes. I'm going to see if a little more water is going to help our suction here. I'm getting suds, that's for sure. It was a little bit of a poop streak on that one. The joys of cloth diapers. Just gonna stick with the diapers for now. <clears throat> Get in suction, that's for sure. And I think it's the suction that's supposed to be doing some of this washing action. I'm definitely getting that. I was worried that this handle seemed loose. But it's mostly not bothering me. It is flexing. It's doing the job. The water has definitely changed color. I don't know if that was long enough, but I'm gonna try putting this in the rinse water. I did put some of the rinse water into the wash water. So we'll see if that's enough or if I need to go add more. Doesn't smell like pee. It's a good start. Some of that change in color of the wash water probably came from the bucket. I don't think I cleaned it as well as perhaps I might have. But these are just diapers that are going to get peed in again anyways. Close enough. out. Yeah, I'm still getting a suction. So I think it's probably more water than I needed in the wash bucket. All right, I think I probably need to do a second round of rinse. Oh, I'm just gonna lower this. Turn that off. And 
go get some more rinse water. All right. I think I used too much soap. Hmm. All right, rinse number three. This is going to be the last rinse. Yeah, I'm doing good. Doing good. The, I mean, the washer seems to be working. It's just user error. Famous last words, last one. Still some suds there. I don't think it's too bad. We're gonna say that's good enough. Let's ring these out. Yeah. That doesn't seem too sudsy. So that was a lot of work for a quarter of a bucket of diapers. But I think if I had gotten the soap amount right to start with, like maybe a quarter of that spoonful, um, it would have gotten rid of a lot of the rinsing work and that would have been getting closer to manageable. I mean, we'll probably be doing this, if we go with this thing, we'd probably be doing it every day or every other day but 10 minutes every other day, I think that might be doable. Um, I think my vote's gonna be to go with this uh, for the time being. But we'll see what happens. And at the end of the season, uh, September, October, November, something like that, uh, I'll make another video and uh, just summing up what we ended up doing and, and how we felt about it. It's not the most solid little thing, uh, but it works surprisingly well. So we'll see whether we end up using it or not. Thanks. So this is a quick addendum. The diapers didn't dry inside overnight, so I've hung them up outside. They do pass the smell test. They'll be stiffer from hanging up rather than going in the dryer, but we'll see if we can rough them up a little and make them acceptable to the little guy and uh, take it from there.